y'all. It's already a whole lot. Okay. So it is 7.20 in the morning. And I think it's time. I've been in very, very extremely uncomfortable since like four o'clock this morning. Yeah, I've been very uncomfortable and it's been feeling more like sore back and, and, and butt hurt and lower back things. I heard something called back labor. It's like my booty sore but I think now it's like going and coming so now I feel like I could poop out my whole life but it hurts too and I don't want to but it's coming back <sighs> that sounds like labor <sighs> now it's going to come in before it was consistent you want to sit down so I don't know what the contractions are because I just realized the contractions and because I know so far dilated, I don't even care. Okay. Uh, I'm just trying to go. Called the hospital and they said if I have to talk, if I have to pause through conversations, then it's probably time to go. So we're doing that, but yeah, I've been on kind of post at four o'clock this morning. Um, been using heating pad since then, um, but I called David at 6.50, he was in the room, and that's kind of when I realized things were going on, so I just took a shower. So, I think I was wearing the same dress in labor with Nala, too, that's good. but I need to get life together so we can get um, Nala out of here. And then I'll get back to you when we're in the car. Almost there. It's that stress. <laughs> I'm in so much pain. I'm over it. No ID. I don't have no ID. And I didn't even think about it until I was already too far here. And I don't know what they're going to do. It might procrastinate. Admitted me because I don't have identification and I don't know what to do about it because I always take my car everywhere. But we're taking his car and I left my car, my ID in the car. So, understand the baby's here y'all we just got here we didn't even have time to bring the camera out we're already in the recovery room and it is what time it is 1 45 so I think the last time we talked to you guys we were in the car so we got here at 8 45 
went straight, well, we had to sit at registration for about a good 10 minutes. And then we went into triage. And then she was like, you're seven centimeters dilated. You're having this baby today. Yeah. And I, I was telling you, it's fine. No. <laughs> Hold on, I'm a shadow. Hold on. Nah, we gotta go back on the side. Can you sit right here? Yeah. It's the kid. I just can't believe that I didn't know that I was about to go into labor. I was she told sick. me to go to work. I told him to go to work. I said, <laughs> go ahead and go to work. She said, go to work. I'm gonna go to the hospital, get checked out. I was like, what? So now, that's the reason why, like, you're gonna see, like, us jumping from the car to here. And that's because that's how fast it was. I was hoping that once I got epidural, when things come down, that's when I can, like, update you guys. But we never got to we that point. We never got to that point. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> we went literally from triage to delivery and had a baby. Yeah. So this is just experience and it's just different. So just come along as we um, see how this situation is. Oh, y'all want to see her hair? Let's see. She doing a little skin skin. She comfortable. She getting her color. She's doing really good. Oh, she's six pounds, 13 ounces. Got a head full of hair. I don't want to take the hat fully off right now. Look at it. She's going to get her bath tonight. Yep. Six pounds, 13 ounces. I guessed it right on the dot. Yeah, she did. She got, <laughs> they were, we were right before they did the weigh, they said, what do you think? I said, what did I say? I said, said six pounds, nine ounces. Yeah, you did. And then you said six pounds, 13 ounces. And she said... Six pounds, 13 ounces. I was like, what? Right on the dot, dang. Yeah, no, she was like, I think, the nurse was like, I think she's gonna be like seven pounds. Oh yeah, all the nurses was like, oh, she's heavy. She's, she's gonna pounds. be a seven pounds. And I was like, I six pounds, so. 13 ounces. <laughs> and then she was like, some kilograms translate, six pounds, 13 ounces. I said, I know my baby. Mm, 19 inches, y'all. Yeah. yeah, she 19 inches. So she's a, like a little bit heavier than Nala was, but she's shorter. The dollar, but that's to be understood because I'm five days, four days longer pregnancy with this baby. So, and they said her head is perfectly round, perfectly round. So, we'll definitely come back when it's time to um, just we'll just check in and out throughout the day as mm -hmm. we get to know our new baby girl. And yeah, but how do you feel? Still trying to catch up. You know? yeah. <laughs> I feel like everything just went so far in front of me. Yeah. <laughs> I don't think it hit me yeah. yet. I don't know about you, but it hasn't really like dawned, dawned, dawned on me. I know when they put her in my hands, because I was the first one to hold her, it just felt felt natural. felt like, you know, I'm a G at this. Yeah. You know, I've done this before. I ain't, I ain't scared no more. Yeah. I was scared, but no. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> but it was like, all right, cool. Definitely feel like a veteran versus mm -hmm. stuff like when they saying stuff i'm like do this do that and i already know what i want mm -hmm. or whatever and i ain't really scared and then even when not holding her i'm like just like no i'm tired like she she <laughs> should be there like she ain't going nowhere <laughs> or whatever like you know so now we doing a little skin to skin she seems real comfortable now Mm -hmm. She getting her little color. I don't think she's gonna have jaundice or anything like that. When you was gone, the, um, the pediatrician came. Oh, yes. Yeah, so Which one? Who? Yeah, a new person? Her, yeah. Oh. And yes. Yeah, what so she said? A lot. A lot. Yeah, but she said everything was fine with her. Mm -hmm. And we go to the doctor in three days. So we gotta set up a doctor appointment. Yeah, to go get checked out. But. Wow. We're probably going to order something. I'm really tired. I need a nap to process everything. So now we're probably just going to get unpacked, get situated. I ain't even get to wear my labor outfit. <laughs> so sad. But I brought my cover though. My cover's always a hit. Everybody's like, you're very smart for having that. I'm like, no. <laughs> so yeah. And your pillow behind you? And my pillow. I had to change it. So yeah, and then there's, there hasn't been a lot of blood either. Hasn't been a lot of blood? You say, you say all you had was a little bit of scar tissue and you, you no know, tears or anything like that. So. Yeah, and I peed like a gallon. So hopefully it's a fast. Right after. Yeah, she peed a lot. <laughs> it was like a gallon. But hopefully it's a fast recovery. Yeah. yeah, I already feel like a little slightly back to normal, but I just need a good nap and food.
Look how dark. Mm-hmm. They chocolatey. Yeah, chocolate baby. Yeah, you might be a little chocolate. Not though. And you probably stand over there. You just want you? Hmm? Oh yeah, that's oh, how it you. was. That's how it was in the last one. Yeah. Alright, so I feel a little bit more like myself. Uh, it's been about an hour and a half, I think, since we last checked in on you guys. And I just feel like it should be time to feed. So she is sound asleep. One thing I do remember when Nala was born, it did take a while to uh, for her to desire to eat. So she ate not too long after she was born, but it's like 3.30 now. So I think she should be eating again. So I'm gonna try to see if she wanna eat. So this will be my first time feeding her or whatever. And I want her to eat also before I get sleepy so that she won't wake up crying. So they did give me the Similac uh, Pro Advance and pretty much the same kind that I got back at home. So of course she's not gonna drink all this in an hour. So I deem that we've got to be spoiling a lot of their bottles, but um, she ate 30, um, 30 ounce, uh, not ounces, 30 milliliters. Um, when she was first born, which is a lot, way more than Nala. Nala only drank 12. So, um, yeah, I'm about to feed her for the first time or whatnot, but she gone. Look at her. <laughs> but she's starting to like twitch a lot and stuff like that. So, I guess that she's about to start waking up anyway. She definitely cries more than Nala did. Look at her little face. Look at her little face and body. So, you gotta eat, baby. Put a little bit, squirt a little bit out on her lips so she knows good. Come on, baby. I don't know. Don't cry. It's good for you. Come on, baby. Actually, let me unwrap her. Because sometimes it takes them to be naked. Not naked, naked, but you know. To want to eat. Look at how small her little legs are. Come on, baby. Let's try to wake her up a little bit. Wakey, wakey. Wakey, wakey. You know what? She ain't cried through none of her shots, did she? Yes, she did. She did? Sorry, y'all. My camera died. Room service just came a lot faster than I thought. Um, that wasn't long at all. It's only 3.40. I think I put in the order, what, like 10, 15 minutes in? So, we got... Oh, my bad. Let me show y'all. It's not. We don't get special dinner here. But we got fries, chicken tenders, Sprite. We got um, mac and cheese. And what is that? Hey. Oh. <laughs> soup. Hey, you didn't even know what it is. No. It's soup. He's just spilling. And vanilla, hot chocolate. Vanilla ice and cream. vanilla ice cream. And 
That is our dinner. No, we don't get special dinner like on the house, but yeah. But this girl act like she don't want to eat, so I'm gonna try to get her naked in order to see if she want to eat then. Let me see. <laughs> I need you to eat, girl. You gotta eat. You better wake you. You just wanna sleep. You just wanna sleep, baby. She has the roundest face. <laughs> Come on now. Work with me. Work with me, girl. You got to eat something. I'll let you sleep a little bit longer. I'll try again in like 20 minutes. Hi, can we help you? Yeah, I don't see any uh, baby wipes. Do y'all have any? They're um, in the blue and white box in the top drawer of the crib. You just have to get them wet with warm water. Oh, okay. Okay? Okay. Bye. Mm -hmm. Just say free black young, free young. Lenny Woods and